Hey, what's up guys, Zeki Senpai here, and yes, I am no longer an ambassador, and I'm sorry, I haven't been making any Final Fantasy VII The First Soldier. I have told the team that I've decided to quit Final Fantasy VII The First Soldier, not because I hate this game or not, I truly enjoy it, and I truly miss... I, when I think back about the Bahama, you know, the Bahama Raid, I have so many memories about the team in the issue, and you know, congratulations Verinius and Cecilia for becoming ambassador as well, and all the best for Stormy Breaker, Elemair, and as well as... Nox, the best ambassador of all time, on what you're doing. So the reason why I quit was because of a few reasons. Final Fantasy VII First Soldier is actually not doing so good on my channel. And I, I really love this game. I really love Final Fantasy VII. I really love Crisis Core. It has been my all-time favorite. And um, yeah, there's actually not much to talk about. I just don't feel like, you know, ghosting my audience. They haven't subscribing it. Uh, if you want to, you know, if you want to unsubscribe for that content, you, you're welcome to do it. But I do appreciate that you've been sticking with me during my first Soldier company. I do want to continue playing this game, but the only problem is that um, sometimes I try to cast Firaga, I try to tap the screen, I try to tap melee. The button just still doesn't work. And when it comes to, when it, when it comes to for Android, right? When it comes for Android, um, sometimes the screen and there's still like loading problem, like there's still some loading loading bug or loading loading delay. But honestly, I really enjoy the Midgar plate site. It's very fun. I I really do enjoy traveling around it. But I, I still like like the six seventy. You see, sometimes I walk to a certain place. I still had a little frame drop, rendering drop. I don't know. Like a lot of games that I play, like Apex Legends mobiles, uh, Super Mega Champion, or even Tower of Fantasy Genshin Impact, doesn't give me this kind of problem and luck in between and yeah I, I love this game it's just that a few reasons it's still a little bit buggy there for, at least for android and also the fact that uh what's that other thing it's not doing so well on my channel and I, I feel like i'm a little bit greedy to say this but yeah i do enjoy playing it <laughs> oh screen freeze again and it's cr it's incredible that they were able to implement the whole shit here like the whole map I saw Verinius, I saw Sasia's uh, videos, they, they were talking about the wet material. Really awesome, and uh, I remember this path where, you know, in Crisis Core, Zack was riding the, the motorcycle to, to talk with Angie. I, I really can't remember, and then Angie was like flying and grab him, and somewhere around the Bahama Fike, that was so epic. I don't regret, um, I have no regret the money that I spent in this game, I still like, I still think that I might come back, check from time to time, I really love the Zack outfit. I really love the great uh, Buster Sword, even in Tower of Fantasy, I have a great sword. I just, you know, kind of like Buster Sword a lot, you know, uh, in, even in Tower of Fantasy, I think it's gonna remind me. And yeah, I don't like building two Buster Sword because it feels weird, so my main weapon is gonna be a Katana in this game. I don't know if I wanna keep continue playing this game, like, it's fun, but depending on, you know, whether it, they, they manage to fix because I don't really wanna buy an iOS phone just to play this game when all my other games doesn't lag out. But again, I really like the exploration man, I really like the new job uh, machinist, and uh, overall a lot of things that I know they removed Shiva and maybe they might add Shiva to become actually much more useful. I'm really proud because today when I woke up, I checked my Facebook memory, it was actually the first day that I tried out the beta test for Final Fantasy VII The First Soldier, and it was actually, you know, a memorial day. I was like, I don't care if People are not gonna watch my content. I'm gonna try making contents for this game, but eventually it's not doing so well, I guess. Again, I, I like the 60 FPS didn't really help me a lot. Like it wasn't really the 60 FPS problem or the FPS problem. It's the loading problem in this game. But again, I really like the exploration mode. I really like a lot of things they have done, except for the gacha. I have seen the Sephiroth skin. Some people told me that the weapon skin. I actually got the assault rifle. Let's see if we can get an assault rifle. I also forgot to point out that I have been working out, cooking by myself, like, you know, taking care of myself instead of just to focus on YouTube, spending more time with my girlfriend, you know, just doing things I love, clearing my JRPG backlog, just aside from growing the channel, so it's, it's just that I have more, more things to prioritize, like the important things first, but First Soldier indeed, uh, if, it, if it did succeed, I would have liked to cover it, but I feel like I also feel like, you know, I, I, it's better that you check out people like Verinius, um, Verinius, Elemair, or even Sasia. No, they're, they're more dedicated, they more care about the community more than I do, where I think more of the YouTube aspect. And I, and I truly felt sorry for that as well. Now, I'm playing other games like Super Mega Champion or Tower Fantasy. They are growing the channel, but it doesn't mean that I'm not having fun. I'm also having fun with them. And I'm also having fun with First Soldier. And when it comes to the benefit, 
I much choose the one that benefits both sides, right? Like, it's fun also growing my channel. I managed to grab an assault rifle. I managed to get the Sephiroth assault rifle with the one wing angel. I, I don't know what it, it feels weird, but it's a super cool skin. I like it. I like it. Like if you try to view it further, you can't zoom out apparently, but it's still it's still really cool. It has the feather effect. It would be really cool if you if you shoot and it's like a sparkle to the Mako. That'd be super cool. But uh, so far we don't see a lot of effect. I guess someone's right here. <laughs> it's so weird. My, my, you see, sometimes I still lag in between when I try to fight someone And when I bring out the gun, oh shit, it's the gravity When I bring out the gun Sometimes some buttons don't work Look at the amount of lag I'm having I'm not, I know I'm playing in high graphic, but if other games are not suffering, I don't know Maybe I might get a better phone to play this game, I don't know But I really enjoy this game and I truly, truly love it Like, it's an amazing game it's it's full of potential. It never comes out to PC, but that doesn't matter because I play games on mobile too. I really love Final Fantasy VII: The First Soldier. It's it sits there. The first day when a bunch of my friends went with me together on the first day, the the President Cup where I managed to get I think top ten with Waltz and Varinius. Also the bomb launcher meta. <laughs> this guy is shooting it, and also a lot of meta. Like the first time we see Bahama. Oh my! Oh my God! We can play Bahama, and then when Dragoon got released and stuff like that. Yeah, certainly it's gonna give me a lot of memories, and thank you all so much for supporting me throughout my Final Fantasy VII First Soldier uh, content. I I really feel like in, in my heart it's like a little spot that wants to come back, but again, it just dude, stop shooting me. It just you know, I move on. Again, thank you all so much. It's <laughs> hey, it's just a gaming channel.